okay. Sure you close up. Man. Oh. Looks like we made a great miscalculation, inmate. Contrary to our assumptions, it seems you have turned out to be quite promising. Your powers continue to grow, as do the relationships you hold with your contractors. It seems the rehabilitation is proceeding at a fine rate. Allow me to warn you on one matter. Being at the peak may mean you are mere moments from your downfall. Unexpected situations are necessary in a game, after all. <laughs> Dream again. What the hell? I'm human. I have to be. I... There's no way I was born like that. I won't let myself get worked up over some dream. I'm sure everything will be clear if we can get to the depths of Mementos. Morning! No way, man! Now everyone! Well... What's this about? What do you want to do? That's annoying. Yep. Well then. What would you like? What would you like? 
here.
Okay, going home. Okay. Looks like this Okumura case is finally going to have a happy ending. All that we have to do now is wait for his change of heart. being here dressed in a normal outfit. Well, I'm completely done with that part-time job. Oh, and my students. I've been giving them all a lot of advice. So, um, about that talk we had? You know, about whether or not we should date? I'm sorry. I feel the same way. I was so happy when you shared your feelings the other day. I finally realized how I felt. But... I'm a teacher, and you're my student. You're in a tricky situation as it is. If we get caught, suspension would be just the beginning. I'm restraining myself because you're so special to me. Where does that confidence come from? Ah! Why are you so okay with this? Now I feel dumb for trying to back away. I had every intention of saying goodbye to you. Oh, fine. Why would you like a woman like me? You're a high school student with strange tastes. Or is that the sort of thing a member of the Phantom Thieves is into? That whole thing with Takase-kun's guardians worked out way too good for me. And you're the only one who knew about my situation. Hmm, well... Don't worry, I have no intention of telling anyone. There are a lot of stories about the Phantom Thieves, but in the end, they help people like me, right? That's so you. I just thought you were a problem child with a criminal record, but now I know better. I'll support you 100%. You're not just a student to me. You're someone special who helped me realize my path as a teacher. A new path where I'll never abandon any of my students. Right? For my students and for you. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a 
your blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened the ultimate secret of temperance, granting thee infinite power. All right. All right. Life really is a roller coaster, isn't it? I went from being a teacher to being a maid to dating a high school student. So, as someone who went from being my master to my boyfriend, do you have any requests for me? I'll obey them, you know, even though I'm no longer a maid. Be so conceited. You're younger, so you should rely on me. Here, by all means. Looks are so deceiving. I thought you were one of those shy guys who didn't pursue women. Can I stay with you a little bit longer today? <laughs> what 
me see. Um... Yes. I get why Haru is worried, but let's just wait for the change of heart to go through. Don't worry, it'll be just like it always is. Are you sure? Read here. The fee is Vanek Gulak done already? What? It is time, inmate. That's fine. You look serious today. Okay, sounds good. Nice weather like this makes me want to go up into the mountains and blast a few rounds. 
All right, all right, which one? It's that time of year when schools hold their athletic meets, huh? Sounds good. Okay, all right, which one? Hmm, don't break it, okay? That's what you like it? Hmm, you better not use it to pull a prank, huh? Don't break it, okay? That's what does that. Hmm, you like it? That's what does that. Hmm, that one? You like it? That's what you better not use it to pull a prank, huh? Don't break it, okay? Hmm, how's that? That's what you better not use it to pull a prank, huh? You like it? Hmm, how's that? That's what you don't break it, okay? Hmm, you like it? That's what you're chewing to better not use it to pull a prank, huh? How's that? Hmm, that one? Take your time. Sounds good. That's what you like it? Hmm, how's that? Alright, which one? That's what you do like it? Hmm, let me change your mind. That's what don't break it, okay? Hmm, you better not use it to pull a prank, huh? How's that? That's what you do like it? Hmm, how's that? That's what you do like it? Hmm, don't break it, okay? That's what you do that? Hmm, you like it? That's what you better not use it to pull a prank, huh? How's that? Hmm, don't break it, okay? That's what you better not use it to pull a prank, huh? Don't break it, okay? Hmm, you like it? That's what you're Take your huh? You better not use it to pull a prank, huh? How's that? Hmm, you like it? That's what you don't break it, okay? Hmm, how's that? That's what you're too better not use it to pull a prank, huh? Don't break it, okay? Hmm, you better not use it to pull a prank, huh? You change your mind, huh? You like it? That's what you how's that? Hmm, take your time, huh? You like it? That's what how's that? Hmm, you change your mind, huh? You like it? That's what you how's that? Hmm, you like it? That's what you don't break it, okay? Hmm, how's that? Hmm, you like it? That's what you how's that? All right. Nice weather like this makes me want to go up into the mountains and blast a few rounds. You should be grateful. Okay, sounds good. Come again. What's up? Good. Actually... Yo. That's right. Good. <laughs> All right. 
right. Later. By the way, I see. Already? What? It is time, inmate.
on, Mona! Pedal to the metal! Let's burn this... Stupid. Core. She's 
Joker! Hey, you guys again? It's useless no matter how many times you go! A gamer taught you the moves to take him down, right? Teach that stupid cheater a lesson! Impossible! There's no way this could happen! A gunshot that surpasses my cheeks? That can't be true! Dad, I'm the strongest! I'm supposed to be king! Me! He <laughs> me! Let's go! They're done for! How pathetic.
What do you want to do? What shall we do? Thanks for coming in. today. Now, nothing's been decided as of yet, but at the rate that things are going, Yoshizawa-san's honor status could possibly be revoked. Something so serious should, of course, be brought to the attention of both her parents and yourself. I've been told that her results at the latest meet were quite laudable. Isn't revoking her status as an honor student a bit of an overreaction on the school's part? I understand how you feel, but, well, third place doesn't really cut it in this case. She needs to attain first place results for her exceptional status to be worthwhile. Don't get me wrong here. Uh, personally, I think her results are impressive, but... I suppose the argument could be made that if she's going to represent Shujin and receive special treatment, it's not enough. Please don't shoot the messenger here, okay? Uh, this is necessary to guarantee fairness across the entire student body. It's not as if you've been expelled or the like. Uh, another meet's coming soon. Please try for the results the school wants to see. Sir, putting excessive expectations on Yoshizawa-san will only be to her detriment. 
Oh, that wasn't at all my intention. I just wanted to give her a little encouragement. Dr. Maruki, please continue serving the student body as counselor and providing support to Yoshizawa-san. This meeting was merely meant to express how the entire faculty will be supporting her. That's the reason I had you sit in today, Dr. Maruki. Supporting her. I see. At any rate, that's all I wanted to discuss with you today. Please keep in mind, these changes are all hypothetical, uh, unless Yoshizawa-san doesn't provide better results. <laughs> well, uh, I suppose we should wrap up here. Uh, excuse me. What's wrong with Yoshizawa? Didn't she seem off to you? It's... Yoshizawa must have dropped it. Shoot, she's gone. Let's return it after school. We should at least send her a text so she knows where it is. Hmm, maybe I left it in here. Huh? How did Yoshizawa-san handle the news? She seemed pretty downcast. I think it was quite the shock to her. I truly hope this is what finally drives her to succeed. She needs to push herself beyond third place and bring home some stronger results. And soon. Vice Principal, I know I've already told you this, but your approach here is going to affect her adversely. Trying to motivate her with harsh words is only going to give her more anxiety. Ah, <sighs> Dr. Maruki, we aren't running a charity. If she's going to receive special treatment, she needs to provide adequate results. Praising her until her head swells may be your idea of therapy, but we can't afford to just butter her up forever. We took in those sisters to improve Shujin's standing, but at this rate, we're only going to end up suffering for it. Not only have we lost one of them, but the other one's not doing us any good. <laughs> Talk about a waste of effort. <sighs> Sir. So, uh, pardon me, but there's no denying. First with Mr. Kamishida, now the principal's death. We've got our backs to the wall here. Huh. If this school doesn't bounce back soon, even my own ass will be on the line. That'll be all. Excuse me. I just cannot understand. This is it. <laughs> That's it. She's at the stadium? Senpai, sorry, I can't hear you. I guess her signal cut out. I couldn't hear everything, but it seems like she's at the stadium. She seemed to be acting unusually this morning, too. Do you think something happened? 
Me too. When we met her there last time, she did mention that she goes there when she's depressed. Well, let's see how she's doing when we drop off her good luck charm. To Odaiba, right? <sighs> no connection. I should have gotten this thing replaced already. I'm so useless. I do nothing but cause trouble for Senpai, and even Dr. Maruki. I'm supposed to be THE Kasumi Yoshizawa. Come on, I want to get a parfait. Yeah, yeah, just a sec. I'm looking up a spot right now. It's supposed to be somewhere around here. Oh, you've gotten us totally lost. I don't recognize any of these places. What's that building even supposed to be, anyway? Uh, I think they're building some kind of convention center. Or was it a research lab? What's it matter, anyway? <sighs> it's not a lab. It's a stadium. Hmm? <sighs> Atmosphere. Is this a palace? But we never activated the nav. Wait, do you think it was Yoshizawa? It's a possibility. She wasn't anywhere near us when we slipped into this palace. She can't fight like we do. We have to find her. Fast! Yoshizawa? Yeah. Stay on guard, though. Why? How are you here? Who's that? Is she a cognitive being? I... It's my fault. What? Come on! You must... Yo, 
Yoshizawa's in trouble. Heresy! You dare to spurn our Lord's mercy! Are you alright, Yoshizawa? That voice... Senpai? <laughs> Looks like that thing's ready to rumble. Accept yourself. Our Lord laments the foolishness birthed from your pain. What are you talking about? I heard the school moved to exam period. It must be nice getting get perks like that. Where are these voices? Her whole I'm not bothered routine really pisses me off sometimes. Getting special treatment is like, like whatever if it's deserved. But do you think she's that's... I understand how you feel, but, well, third place doesn't really cut it in this case. She needs to attain first place results for her exceptional status to be worth. Not only have we lost one of them, but the other one's not doing us any good. <laughs> Talk about a waste of effort. I've had enough of this. Yoshizawa? You're telling me I'm not cutting it? As if I don't know that better than anyone! Still, I don't care what anyone says about me. I will not tolerate anyone speaking ill of our dream! <laughs> it's all in your best interest. <sighs> Filling my life with this pressure? Demanding the results that you want? Yoshizawa? Could she be? And now you're all branding me a failure? Let me remind you who you're talking to. I am... I am... Kasumi Yoshizawa! So adamant. <coughs> Where do I accept a life from cinders? You'd strive towards splendor. You know the rest. If those really are the shoes you've chosen, then we'll dance to the end. This has got to be... This contract, the spell cast upon you. I request we have a rematch. This time, I'm going all in with Sandrion! <laughs> we'll show you the way to do this. Nothing too reckless, okay? Thank you. Please do! Zona Zekarabia Witness my song It didn't work What? Persona! Lilith, dead! Go! Leave it to me! Let's dance! Sandrion! This isn't over! Just like... 
Quite impressed, considering how you just awakened to your persona and all. Senpai, right? I knew it. By the way, why are we dressed like this now? Well, of course. This has to be awfully confusing for her. Looks like they found us. Time to get out of here, quick. We can explain later. Right. Oh, we're back at... Huh? My clothes changed back to normal, too. This was your location before you entered the Metaverse. We all just came back. Came back? Did we go somewhere? Uh, about that. Please, tell me anything you might know about what's going on. I need to know what just happened to me. I know how you feel, but what should we do? Yeah, you're right. Okay, I'll tell you everything from the beginning. Thank you. A metaverse with palaces and personas. I'm sure it's not easy to wrap your head around all of this in one go. Normally, I wouldn't believe any of that, but... After seeing it all for myself... But wow, you're so good at explaining things, Mr. Kitty! I'll let that last part slide this time. But isn't there something else that should be surprising you? Huh? A cat's talking? <laughs> Took you long enough. And I am not a cat! I am Morgana. I see. Well, since you seem to know a lot more about this than I do, Maybe I should call you Morgana, Senpai. Oh, that's right. Don't you have something for her? You came all this way to return this? Thank you so much. You didn't seem your usual self this morning. Did something happen? Well... I didn't get a chance to tell you yet, but... I got third place in the last meet. Of course I'm not happy about it. But it looks like the school is even more displeased. I was summoned to the guidance office this morning. I was warned that the school might revoke my honors status if I don't improve my results soon. It would be due to my own inability to succeed in gymnastics, so... I have to say it's not an unfair consequence, but... I also overheard the vice principal talking about how I'm a useless waste of effort. And I dragged Dr. Maruki into this mess too, since he was with me when I got the news. That's what really got to me. That's a tough break. So I ended up coming here. And then all of a sudden I was in that place we just left. But I'll be just fine now. I feel like whatever happened in there helped me to get over it. I'm going to realize my dream for sure. Seems like you really are on the up and up now. But then again, how did Yoshizawa end up finding a palace in the first place? It sounds like it was pure coincidence based on what she's told us. The nav? Well, I suppose that makes the most sense. Hey, do you mind if we take a quick look at your phone? If the nav's on there, 
We'd be able to tell whose palace that was with the search history. Sure, it's right. Sorry, this won't do any good. What's that? The battery's dead. It's been acting up for a while now, so that could have something to do with it. Oh, really? Shouldn't you get that checked out? Well, it's not like that was a palace we've been after, so I guess it's no big deal. We couldn't make its ruler our target unless we reached a unanimous decision anyway. Okay, I've been meaning to ask. Are you two part of the Phantom Thieves? Um, well, uh, we're... You are, aren't you? I knew it. Wait, that means when we were at the cafe with the Ketchisan, I basically told the Phantom Thieves themselves that I don't agree with what they're doing. Ugh. I'm really sorry. Don't worry about it. With that out of the way, what's your call? That's right. Considering how she did back there, don't you think she'd make a worthy addition to the Phantom Thieves? So, you mean you want me to join the Phantom Thieves? In a nutshell, yeah. You've awakened to your persona, you're aware of the existence of palaces, and from the looks of things, you've got quite the potential. If you're willing to join us, we'd be glad to have you. I see. Hmm. You don't have to give us an answer right now. I mean, you probably shouldn't make any decisions until you learn more about what it is we're actually doing. Thank you, but... I'm sorry. I have to turn down your offer. Cool. So we'll head home for now and... Wait. What? When I awakened to my... Uh, persona, was it? I also realized something. I can't keep obsessing over my shortcomings in gymnastics like this. So that's why I can't join you at the moment. Because you need to focus on your gymnastics. I'm truly sorry to say no after all you've done for me. I appreciate your feeling that way, but I think I'd only cause you all more trouble if I were to join up without being totally invested in it. Of course, I won't say a word about this to anyone. I'm glad you catch on so quickly. Well, if you ever change your mind about us, just let us know, okay? Thank you, Morgana-senpai. If that ever happens, I'll get in touch right away. Yes. I should extend the same gratitude to you as well, senpai. I swear, one day I will repay you for helping me out in so many ways. Shall we get going? Quite a lot's happened today, but I have a feeling I'll try harder than ever before, starting tomorrow. I'm glad to hear it. Well, see you later. Hmm... I mean... Hey! Let's go to bed. <sighs> well then! my father, there isn't anything different about him yet. I can't help but think about a lot of things when I'm just waiting. Things like, did it go well? Th 
Thanks. Hearing that from you puts my mind at ease. <laughs> I guess I'll relax and look after the flower bed. I haven't been able to for a while. Phantom thieves are amazing. Now, what'll you do? I see. Hey, inmate! The real question to be asked. You'd like read here. This a fee is this is your power. Finished. What? No slacking off. Hmm? Oh. Yes. <laughs> the thing is. Oh. 
here with you. Just a little longer. Good night.
Morning. Hmm. Let's get started. Well... What's this? What do you want to do? Yes.
No. the mental shutdowns. It has to be someone dangerous. Now that we're getting closer to the truth, we need to be ready for absolutely anything. Yo. Hey! Oh yeah! Close up. Man. Oh.
All right. Textbooks open to page.
I... Bumpkin, I've always admired it. No, I somehow felt like I wasn't allowed to because I was a monster. But it's all good now. I will no longer be swayed by names like Monster or Maiden. I am simply a fortune teller who provides advice to people with broken spirits so that they will have conviction and face their future without getting pushed around by fate. That's the fate I've chosen for myself. <laughs> Thank you. Now, it's your turn to speak. What would your conviction be as a phantom thief? Sorry, I used fortune telling to find out your true identity. I couldn't help but think that you had something to do with the chairman's confession. Then I discovered that you're the trickster who causes a sensation in the world. It was the same card as the figure who helped me take down the chairman. <laughs> it finally struck home for me. Don't worry, I won't tell anyone. I don't care what my boyfriend's true identity is. As long as you're around, I can always be my true self. So, it's fine. Only... 
The fate of the Phantom Thieves is rather unclear. The Arcana is set in a tricky position. You can almost say it's facing both heaven and hell. This is the first time I've ever seen anything like it. You're right. You have the power to alter fate. Besides, I'll be by your side. As the fortune teller who changes fates, I will guide you so you can avoid misfortune. <laughs> I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened the ultimate secret of fortune, granting thee infinite power. All right. All right. Um, by the way, are you okay with your girlfriend being a country bumpkin? It's become a habit of mine to hide my native tongue, and I'm not used to fancy places like this. Really? I'm so glad to hear that. I was so dang worried. Uh, I'm speaking in my country dialect again. Um, the thing is, I read our relationship fortune today. And it was really, really good. So, um... If you don't have any plans to steal anything tonight, um... Perhaps you can stay... <laughs> stay with me! <sighs> I... I don't know what to do now. I couldn't figure it out with my fortune telling. So, let's figure it out together. Welcome.
Nice. What do you want to do? Let's see how you did. by any time. Ah, you're back. What do you want to do? I should write something. 